Alright, welcome back. We're at the last part of the video and this is the construction crane. This is what I was really looking forward to because I, I really wanted a sort of a construction crane in my CD once I start building it up. Alright, so we'll start with bag A. That was the construction worker or crane operator. I think there's only one, isn't there? Yeah, it looks like it. Here's the walkie talkie. What's with their uh, hands? So, like, can they? grab stuff properly. Can't remember being that hard on before on even newer sets. So there he is, that's uh Tom. Tom the crane operator. Right. Uh side note, make sure you have this long piece here which comes in the bag that has no number. Should be the last item from that bag anyway. So this is bag eight. So we've done the grey. So we need the grey white bit. Maybe the orange stud. Long thing and a red thing and a thing and a thing. A red thing and a black thing. Then one with a hole and an orange block with a thing goes in, spins around two of those. So I'm presuming this is the bottom part or the arm. Looks like the bottom part. Most, mostly the base and the small free. We have one block like that. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there.
Okay, so you add that. Uh, you add the last part. Last. Oh. Why can't you just times that by four? I think these are opposite, that's probably why. Um. As long as the free one is pointing outwards. In a flat piece in the middle there with a long one for the back, turn table piece in the middle, and then another black one there. It should be so they're going to limit. Yeah, follow the wings. Extend the wings. <laughs> That's neat. Um, let's see. Two light studs. Put them on the ends. Two 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 blacks. Freeze where the free goes, free goes. Goes there. Goes there. Green one. Ramp. Ramp. Gate piece. Flat. Round bits at the back with a flat piece. On shape in the middle. The safe. Not really m much room to turn it. It's all turns. Four of these, and then go here, here, and over here, and here two yellow pointing ones with the gates on those and upwards and one flat piece in the back 
two more, four actually. Two flat squares, one rectangular. Uh, square there is two more of these on the end here to line up with the yellows. square ones that go on the edge here makes it all nice and secure and we move on to this flat piece flat piece here and a small one and two arches and these have like red and white striped things goes in the back two of these with a white line in the middle this is the cab now and eight of these Feels weird when I put bits on bits that are barely supported. After that, and then a yellow line. Oh, there you go. Now this. Now it's supported. Two yellow lights on either side. With another yellow bar. Green archway secures that. That secures that. Two of those with two doors. This looks really good so far. Blue block there, steering wheel, that side for the bit, one of these with two yellow light, two yellow, two white lights, and then yellow rail things, and another set of these. That goes on the front. Two yellow things to secure those the doors. Space there. So I think it can fit pretty much to people in there. And that's where it goes on the top of there. And two more of those to secure that completely. And that's bag eight. So we're moving on to bag nine. This is that final bag as well.
also the crane bit for that un, un not numbered bag. Right, so we need plain stud brick. Two yellows. Four of these. <clears throat> and two yellow lights secure those. We have two freeze to freeze or force freeze. Two hook bits. Two of those, so yeah, two of those, two bathrooms. Two yellow ones on there. And a flat, two flat pieces like this with a yeah, sort of a stud bit. Two yellow lights either side. Underneath it. One of these. Completely secure it with a black square. And secure that with a disc. And three of these arch rings. And two ones with the hook things. <coughs> Excuse me. Clips. Um, Need two windows. Oh, I didn't hear a quick sound. Two flat yellow bits. Then you want your window uh, mirrors. It's going to be like that. So it's going to be like that. I thought I did it right the first time, oh well. For all these square ones with the one stud with some sort of torch thing. Oh, these are the, um, the supports.
on the tyres. Six tyres today. So what happens is you're supposed to take the flat pieces off, off the crane, and put them in the, whoops, and put them in the tray spot here when you're not using them. And these can go in now. So I'll put those there for now, but if they tend to fall off, then I'm I'm going to take them out. There we go. So it's got its tyres on. Once you make sure they have enough room to fully spin around. So yeah, those so stabilizers work. Alright, so once that's done, working on the crane now. Just going to put the um, crane, the bottom of the actual crane down. Get the big peaks here. Two young, two long yellow ones. Hopefully, I can do this in like. Five-ish minutes. Uh. And I sort of not rush it, but move fastly. I'm not on the deadline or anything. It's just I want to try and get this done, then show like five minutes of the actual set.
and you put the set numbers on the sides here. Add that to the side one bit. I think this is the first part of the crane. And you need that very long bit in that empty, uh, that unnum not numbered bag. Secured two of those yellow bar things, put stickers on the side of the main thing, uh, stud. Two of these axle things on each side. Blue, you put blue things at the front ones, like that. Go back to your actual set. I don't go high that much. I make the pistons. I'm also going to put a rod. Uh, looks like the second hole. Surprise that's not really secured. That is clever, with the pistons there. And two of these on the side. Going back to the main truck, make sure it's completely sort of flattish. 
put the uh, black pin in. Put that inside again. Grab the black rod. One shot odd 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 piece. Put two of the red small bits in there. Get this rod lined up. Push the bits in, make sure the fatty end is at like the left side. And slide that down the pole. Now the actual winch. Oh, this is a lot of string. That's the only one, isn't it? Yep. Better just to quickly do this bit first because it's a pain when you. This is a lot of string. I'm going to leave this last bit just in case. And one of these at the end. I think I ever did it. <sighs> okay, I went a bit ahead.
Hang on, we've got destruction vein. Put that in. That. Out a little bit, and this is supposed to keep it secure. Looks like it. I put a little knot there so that stays there. And then you add the flat piece, and you put a circle bit there. There you go, that's better. Then they give you a little bit too much string here. Exactly on top of that. Move it through in this hole. All right, so there's still plenty of string to spare. I kind of wish there was um, sort of blocks along along the actual truck, like to keep it all staying in, because that. You know, and make sure it's all staying in, so you know it doesn't lose it its stringing is. Right. A hook. No. There we go. And the last bit is the uh, <clears throat> two of these on on the board with two stripes and that's it and there is your construction vehicle and that is it for the set. I'm not 100% sure what resistor tend to be for though. It, on the first booklet it said something about something about helping you get blocks apart so this is a little handy tool which yeah, didn't really 
used. But besides that, I've got some few spare pieces, and that is it. So I'm going to quickly set up the area and show you the whole set. Okay, <clears throat> after uh, doing some stuff, I rearranged the uh, town, sort of like the uh, the box there. Um, my best. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, so we got the little boy on the skateboard there, um, and he's dog there and he's got his bone. You got the construction guy with his crane. Hmm. That's that's how tall it would go. <clears throat> and um it's got still got plenty of string in the back which is good and sort of bad like if the string reached it to uh right there and say had a little bit more length than enough to put that in the roller then you don't really need that much and oops I don't mean, mean to break that ah uh, there so. um but yeah I like the crane then we got the uh the lady with your little mower or cleaner He sits in there, uh, like that, and she does the cleaning. Sorry about the uh, shake in the camera, I'm not really I'm used to aiming this and all that. I had it on the tripod. Then you got the bus driver, and he's just gone over, he's doing a DUI. And the doors open up easily. And it goes in there. And I said he goes in there. Well, you get the point anyway. So you get the bus, bus stop there. Then you got the shop. The guy on the motorbike there. You got the shop. And that. Mine's supposed to be over there. The doors twirl around. And you got the second story there. Give you guys a back view as well. And lastly, it's the pizza joint. I got the chef there and cut in the two people in the pizza shop there. And if I put the bigger figures out of the way, turn that around, give you a back, bit of a back view. Um, also the statue. So yeah, so I think this is an alright set, a little bit steep for what I purchased for, but then again it is like two years old or so, I don't know when it was really made, I think it was late 2012 or early 2013. Um, uh, like I said, um, it was the cheapest one I could find on eBay and I went like why not, just grab it. And um, thanks for watching guys, sorry it's a very long lengthy parts of the videos um, but like I said I do these builds um, normal speed so you guys can watch it instead of high speed I give comments and talk about the sets and all that that guy been doing I think it's a great little set a little bit too steep but maybe you can get it cheaper somewhere else I don't know if it still sells in stores probably Target I think I heard that's where it's still sell it but I checked their website and couldn't find it um, yeah, hopefully the next big set I'll build will be not that big, but something smaller. Thanks for watching, please like, comment and subscribe, and have a nice day.